This is Dakota News Now Sports. Though the Sioux Falls Canaries have cooled off a bit with losses in three of their last four games, they're still in ideal position to make the playoffs. With the top four teams in their division getting into the postseason, the Birds are currently in third place with a three and a half game lead over fifth place Lincoln. Win in today's series finale could all but lock up a playoff spot, meaning KG might have to work a bit of overtime pretty soon. Bottom one, Aaron Whitefield going to work after a leadoff walk, reached second on a sacrifice, steals third, and then comes home on an error. Birds lead 1-0 without a hit. And that freeloader actually gets up and does some moving because of it. Canaries defense putting in their time to make the lead stand. Bases loaded with two outs in the second. Zane Zerbrug drive to right. Hunter Clannon leaps to rob him of a go-ahead hit. In the next inning, man on first for Jason Rogers. He hits a doggy alum Jordan Barth. Nifty glove flip to start the 6-4-3. Twin killing. Entering the fourth inning, the Canaries were still looking for their first hit with two aboard. Looks like Darnell Sweeney's got it, blasting one to right. Nick Anderson going for it, runs hard into the wall. Can't come up with it, two score, and Sweeney ends up with a triple. Focus immediately turns to Anderson, who was down at the wall for several minutes. A medic did come out, but the good news is Anderson eventually got up and left the field under his own power. When play resumed, Hunter Clannon brought Sweeney in with a single, and the Canaries went on to take the series with a six to nothing victory. So here's a look at the standings as we enter the final week of play. Sioux City and Fargo Moorhead, by the way, are underway as we speak. The Canaries currently 48 and 46 with a four and a half game lead on Lincoln. The Salt Dogs have seven games left while the Birds have six. So Sioux Falls magic number to clinch a playoff spot, which is any combination of Canary wins or Lincoln losses is just three. The Birds host their final home games on Tuesday and Wednesday against Winnipeg.